Here we go. Chapter 5. The Italian Grand Prix. While the grid heads to Monza, the team at Racing Point have managed to find some welcome consistency during the second half of the 2020 season. Both drivers are hungry to gain ground on, in competition, but Aiden Jackson is determined to outperform his teammate Casper Ackerman, both in the standings and in the eyes of the team. The Italian Grand Prix, several weeks later. I'm not sure if it's something to do with the energy storage. I'm losing power on the straights. The acceleration is okay. Hmm. Take a look at it. And how are we today, chips? Everything's running smoothly, I hope. Oh, all right, Brian. Yeah, we're just going through a few last-minute tweaks. Ah, that's what I like to see. With dedication like that, maybe you'll be able to get us back a few more of those points. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll try. Actually, Aiden, I'm glad I've caught up with you. Uh, I thought you might like to know. I had a call this morning from Toto Wolf. Mentioned you directly. Sniffing around for next season. You're being watched. So, no pressure then. So, uh, what's the problem with the car? I'm losing power on the streets. It's not a massive issue. I'm sure we can deal with it. Yeah, theoretically, do we have time to install the Spec 2 unit before the race? Yes, boss. And Casper's reporting no problems. No. Okay. Let's do it. Put the spec to an Aiden's, would you? Well, that would sort it. I mean, if you're sure. Well, of course. <laughs> you could do with a little boost. <laughs> a little boost. <laughs> Besides, <laughs> anything for our star driver. Hold on! Oh, wait a minute! The line from the teaser. That line from the teaser. Oh, Ackerman is. Ackerman ain't happy! This is not going to end well. Ryan. Hey, I'm glad I've caught you. Listen, don't worry about Casper. Let me stop you there. Brian, Casper's the furthest thing from my mind right now. I've got a race to focus on. Good man. In the garage just now. That was my fault. I know how he can be. What? Childish? Self-centered? I'm sick of it, Brian. He's been on my case ever since I joined the team. He needs to grow up. Okay, okay. You just need to your head in the right place. Let's put that to good use. Sure thing, Brian. Are you on the other side? Alrighty then. Jackson looks to take full advantage of his car's new power unit. To the, to the vexation of his teammate, Casper Ackman. With the grid set, his focus locked in. Jackson is eager to show Ackman why Racing Point signed him. Italian Grand Prix, race day. The Ackman, all I need to do. A start from Jackson already. P9 from 18th on the grid. already <clears throat> this is going to ruffle the feathers of the t oh wait I have ruffled the feathers of the Tifosi <clears throat> did you 
Scary Chicane. Got so much more straight line speed. <coughs> there is Mr. Ackerman. Thanks for the tow, Ackerman! Send on Verstappen! Bye! Nani? Never stood a chance. <clears throat> Never stood a chance. Now, sayonara, suckers! Do not mess with me! I'm going to be the only one on soft here when else is on mediums. <laughs> They are stupid. Another win for Jackson. Two wins the season. Quick showing off. No, 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 no. It's more like it. Another 2.1. Boom, 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 boom! Baby! And thus, I keep the lead. And there is nothing those can do about it. Albert on the hearts.
and another faster slap, and another win. That's two wins this season for Aiden Jackson, I'll take that. Well, 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 quite the rivalry forming between the rookie Aiden Jackson and his veteran teammate Casper Ackerman. Yeah, it reminds me a little bit of when Hamilton signed from Claren back in 2007. We all know how that one ended. Alonso returned to Renault pretty much the moment the season wrapped up. Well, let's hope it doesn't come to that. Racing points performance today has that they competed with the feds of the sort. They're making their way out to the podium now as we speak. And the reaction from the crowd must be incredibly uplifting for them. remaining in the season time is running out for racing points to secure the points needed to finish above their mid-pack rivals in the constructors championship a dip in form over the past few races has has the team desperately hoping for a strong performance from both rookie aiden jackson and veteran casper ackman Mexican Grand Prix two months later. Ricardo leaving Renault. He'll be joining McLaren. Ah, Lucas Weber. Mumsy. Mum? Aiden, I'm here. Oh, good. After that flight delay, I was starting to get concerned. Don't worry. Everything's fine. And they're uh, looking after you? Better than at Silverstone. Good, because you were my lucky charm there, Mum. And I'm hoping you do the same here. I'll try, love. Now just do what you do, and everything will be great. I know. Mirror signal manoeuvre. And always stick to the, the speed, speed limit. limit. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try. Have a great race, Aiden. I'll see you after. I'm so pleased you're here, Mum. This one's for you, eh? Another 1,000 XP. Head straight to the race. With only a handful of laps remaining. Racing Point is looking to both of its drivers for points in order to improve their position in the standings. One last push is needed for Maiden Jackson, desperate to keep pace with his teammate Casper Ackerman. Mexican Grand Prix mid race. Did not catch a word of what he said. Catch, Ack catch up to Ackman before lap 17. Really frustrating that the audio keeps cutting out. Well, when I'm using a head. 
it set anyway. Jove it is! Bottas! P10! Out of the way! Vettel. Ricardo. It's Ricardo before I Shouldn't be too difficult. Very long run down to turn one. Almost a second and a half behind him now. Come on. It's clear from anyone watching, either in the stands or at home, the determination on show from Racing Point and Aiden Jackson. We go into the stadium today. section. Uh, you're not wrong there, Ant. The performance has improved right. 
race by race throughout the season and is driving today impeccable here's a test room now though as they head down the main straight there's a lot of friction between these two and his teammates after him willie budge old position aiden oh, i've never seen anything like this on a racetrack before two teammates oh, well, there's the theme there's the theme oh no No, that's a lot of damage! <sighs> Disaster. With neither driver willing to cede the position, Jackson and Ackerman make contact heading into turn one. Both cars sustain terminal damage, ending the race for rating point, the rating point pair, and shattering the team's dream of securing a top five position. The Constructors Championship, Mexican Grand Prix, post race. I think I'm going to need to call it there. Recording for the last couple of hours. This is not going to end. That has to be Jackson. Yeah, that's Jackson. He is livid. He hasn't even taken his helmet off. That's when you know. Serious. That's when you know things get serious. When the driver refuses to take their helmet off. chances this season the team is bigger than you two and your petty squabbles grow up anymore and you're both out do you hear me i'll finish the season behind the wheel myself if i have to both of you get out To say he's unhappy would be a massive understatement. to Ackerman's perspective. Very interesting.
Feels akin to Suzuka 89. That's the boss. That's the boss of the team. Oh, no. Ah, it's Lucas Weber. Yeah, probably for the best. Probably best. 500 XP, which leaves me with just under 7,000 before I hit prestige level 2. That being said, that's it for breaking point right now. Next season, here we are. It's 2021, a new season, and with the possibility of a fresh start for Casper Ackerman and Racing Point, following the unceremonious end to the team's chances in the 2020 season, both Driver and team are looking to deliver a strong start to the season opener in Melbourne. Here we are then, another season of Formula One racing is upon us. Some teams come for points and trophies, trophy and chipping hunting. Points and trophies, trophy and chipping hunting. Qualifying gets underway here in Melbourne. So, Aiden Jackson in ninth. Aston Martin still hopeful the youngster can secure a decent position. Let's see how he gets on here. Teammate Casper Ackerman didn't make it through to Q3, narrowly missing out by just 13 milliseconds. He did all you could. If I went out second today, I would have those 13 milliseconds back, no problem. Why do they keep sending me out first? 11th isn't the end of the world, Casper. You'll make those places back. That's where we'll leave it, folks. Until then, see you guys next time.